you are watching networking ruin after watching this video tutorial series you will become a beginner to an advanced level user of nmap let's start the video you can use nmap on any linux distribution that's why i am using mint you can use kali linux and map comes pre-installed on the Kali Linux but I want to show you how to install the nmap that's why I'm choosing Linux Mint so this is our terminal type sudo app install and map press enter type your root password installation of nmap is completed now to run the nmap we need our metasploitable machine and here we have it if you don't know how to install metasploitable 2 on your virtual box then check the link in the description for that video let me clear the screen and to do that we have to be on the same network as our metasploitable machine let me check the ip address of this linux mint machine and to do that i have config and our ip address is standard 0.2.15 let's go to the metasploitable 2 type the same command ifconfig and this is on 192 network so they are not on the same network this means nmap will not work with this let me show you how to fix this thing as well click here on this machine button click on the settings click on network click here on NAT and choose the bridge adapter press ok wait for a few seconds and rerun the command ifconfig and here we are we are on 192.168.1.5 now we are on the same network as our metasploitable 2 machine so clear this press enter to run the nmap command is very simple type nmap space ip address and the ip address is again 192.168.1.8 this is a basic scam you will see a few things come up on the screen me after pressing the enter let's do that here we have the result of the scan the scan has been completed by default nmap scans 1000 most popular ports on machine out of 1977 were closed and here we have the result which are open so let me show you something the latency what is this latency latency means how good is your connection with the host that you are scanning so we have pretty low latency this means we have a very good network so the first thing is port these are the tcp ports which are currently open on our metasploitable 2 machine the state meaning status this is open this can be filtered and this can be closed as well so these are the services which are running currently on our metasploitable 2 machine why do we need to know these things if you want to become a hacker then you should know about these things because these are the ports that we will be using in our upcoming videos to scan different websites and scan the entire subnets and those topic will be coming up soon in my later videos motive of this series is to make you literate about how nmap is a crucial tool in terms of ethical hacking i hope you like my content if you do make sure you press the thumbs up button and share this video with your fellow ethical hackers and don't forget to subscribe Networking Roots signing off.